because it is July, between July 1st and September 30th, we are officially in quarter three of 2024. Quarter three is when they, when they, Hive Mapper, will begin shipping the Hive Mapper B, the new and improved hardware used to uh, map and mine the honey token. Uh, now, with that being said, they've never done anything on time ever in the history of this project. And now they're on a, on a countdown. They've got about 80 days left to officially get this out in quarter three. And there has been no news. To start on, getting it out. To start getting out. They don't have to get them all out. But they said that the goal was to start getting them out quarter three. So we're assuming by the end of quarter three, which is September 30th, which is about 79 and a half days away. Real bad man. But we haven't seen a prototype and we haven't had any update from the company this summer. So who knows what's going to happen? It is still, I, I like to, you know, give them a hard time because ever since day one last year of me ordering the Hive Mapper S and then waiting six months and then having to change it anyway, I've been struggling with their hardware releases. But yeah. ever since I got the hardware I did get, it's been a complete money maker, and for that I cannot. I'm not talking smack on Hive Mapper. That's for sure. I love the project. I love Hive Map, and I drive enough that it's very lucrative. It it was very very lucrative last year. It's still lucrative with the coin coming down about 65 70 percent, and I have enough coins now. If the price goes back up. I'm going to pay off the cars that I'm driving with them. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah. It's kind of funny. Like, you know, people get in my truck and they're like, what is that? And I'm like, oh, it's a, it's a crypto miner. And they're like, what, how's that? And I'm like, well, you know, it's like, you know, Google might give them the deal. And they're like, they're like, how do you make any money? And I was like, well, I made like, I made like 250 last month. And they're like, oh, that's good. And I'm like, yeah. And at the tokens all time high, it would have been $1,200 last month. Right. They're like, oh, how do I get one of those? Right. Yeah, that's what I'm at. Uh, on my, I cashed out big in December, and so I tell people I have cashed out ten thousand six hundred dollars after buying a whole bunch of new electronics and pre ordering 10 of these 550 dollar mm. bees. So I've already paid for 10 more of these bees, and right now I've already got 60,000 tokens again. So you know, at a 10 cent token, it's worth 6,000. But right now we're bouncing between like five and eight cents. So I've got between three and 4,000 bucks at any given time. And that's why I tell people, you know, I mean, when I sold in December, it was like 30 cents a coin. So if I could get back up to there, I'm at over 20,000 bucks. You know what yeah. I mean? And we say that a lot in crypto and it's like, oh, well, if the coin goes, boy, yeah, you know, that's, that's the <laughs> yeah. battle is first the coin has to go up and then I have to have the good sense to sell it when it does. But <laughs> uh, Well, you know, when it's, it starts with, do I, do I believe in the project? You're like, yeah, full heartedly. So if I believe in the project, then I clearly believe the token is going to go back up. So then it's just a matter of time. Right. And, and that's what, I mean, at this point, it would only have to go up to one quarter of its all time high for me to make significant money. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I don't even need it to go all the way back up, although I still think that it it will reach all-time highs. Right now, I've got so many tokens that it's like, it's perfect. I'll just keep earning those tokens. And for me, the bull run can take as long as it wants. In fact, I actually, let me finish talking about the B. The B is yep. the new hardware that's coming up. It's supposed to start shipping in quarter three. Personally. There's a lot of people in the Discord that think that it's going to happen, or at least they'll start getting them out before October. I think we'll be lucky to get them by summer of next year because we haven't even seen like a prototype unless they're getting ready to really, you know, come out with like a, a huge announcement. They've got it and it's ready, in which case the coin will jump, will skyrocket. Yeah, yeah. But uh, I'm planning on having it by next summer and getting everybody outfitted. Um, I've put my first person onto my fleet, which is, uh, you know, uh, it's where I bought the camera and 
this fella drives with it. And so I hooked him up. I got his phantom wallet set up and we've got a 50 50 split. You can see over here. So at the end of every week, it just automatically gives him 50% of the tokens that he's nice. matched and 50% to me. And this was just kind of like a, a practice. In fact, I went down and visited my buddy down in Biloxi and I gave him one of my cameras. Now I'd already ordered him two, but we ordered in January. So it was like, <laughs> <laughs> who knows when those will come well as yeah. soon as i left biloxi he got an email saying that his cameras were in route so he'll have, <laughs> he'll have two cameras he'll send me back my camera but he'll have two vehicles going and i'll have them both on this here uh the fleet which hive mapper while the coin has been going down the project they've really been getting a lot of cool features on their website you can get in here and you can see how much money you're making, how much tokens you're making every week, how much your deposits are, the regions, your mount rating, which is how nice the camera is. And you can manage your fleet, which like I said, here's uh, the fella that's mapping for me. He's only done one week and the payday is tomorrow. So I'm excited to see what my first 50-50 split with him is. But and if you've been watching our videos, you already know this, but Hive Mapper, you map through Sunday, Monday through Sunday. Then you have to have it all the photos uploaded no later than Tuesday afternoon, basically. And then you get paid on Thursday, direct deposit. Yep. And now they've, they've really streamlined that. It used to be kind of staggered, started on Thursday, but, you know, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. But now it's like, boom, by Thursday morning, the deposits are in. And uh, so I'll have mine, which I had a trip from Ohio to Kansas and then back. So I should have a good chunk for me. But then I've also got the 50-50 split of my buddy down in Biloxi. Professor. Yeah. So then when I get the the Hive Mapper Bs, I'll have 10 of those. I'm not sure if they're going to do two per car or just the front. So I might have three cameras on mine. But then I, I ordered the LTE version so I could get the SIM card in yeah. there. So yeah. then I'll have seven other ones, and then I'll go around and I will build a 10-car fleet with honey just coming in every week. I'm ready for it. Hope that coin goes up. And, yeah. Are you worried about individuals taking care of it? Or, like, I've kind of thought, because I have some on the way thinking this through, where I'm like, hey – I need you to take this in every night. Like I'm going to, I'm going to set it up as easy as possible, but don't leave, you know, if you're not parking in a garage, yeah. you park outside, I need you to disconnect and take it in. So it doesn't get stolen It because it's 550 bucks. That's one thing, but it's going to take me a year and a half to get another. So, <laughs> right. Well, you know, I used to disconnect mine at the end of every night and, uh, and hide it. And then I actually just made these little sun visors for them. I don't know if I've showed mm -hmm. you <laughs> It's yeah. out of a regular one. And so it blocks it. Now, if somebody knows what it is, they still know it's it's a valuable camera. But currently, the secondhand market for cameras is not what it was three months ago. Three months ago, you could have sold one on eBay for three thousand dollars, and now you can sell one for five or six hundred bucks. But with the bees, I don't know how you know. I don't know what the secondhand market on that will will be. So I'm not too worried about it. The first time I have one stolen, then we'll lock it down. Then we'll mm -hmm. figure out a plan. But uh, I uh, personally, so, I haven't had any issues and I live in a terrible neighborhood in Dayton. I've got cameras in all of my vehicles. So no gotcha. issues. So yet. to go back, so no update yet. And if I remember right, they were talking about the prototype was going to be released like the 1st of May. And that, of course, never didn't happen. Right. And historically, they've been behind. So you're you're just basically figuring on next summer. I know when I bought them, in my mind, I was like, okay, they're supposed to start shipping, you know, third quarter. I'm just going to be happy and expect it to be here by the end of the year. Um, have you been, I haven't been following, have they given, you know, last I looked, probably six weeks or something ago, they were talking about how they had, they've gotten production down and ramped up or was, and this was with the HTC, HTC the, the, right. the current camera, but they were talking about how we've got it figured out that way. The B will just, you know, well, it'll just, we'll just stop production on HTC and roll right into the B. Obviously you got to have a prototype and all that stuff, but yeah, so that's no, no, I'm, they've had radio silence as far as the production, huh? I'm hoping that they're that they're preparing for a grand reveal 
You know, right. I think that their back end stuff, they were so overwhelmed with the HTC that they got behind and they never caught back up. I mean, they're yeah. still not caught back up. My yeah. buddy from Biloxi ordered those cameras in January and it's halfway through July. I do remember reading, I'm pretty sure, which, you know, it's one thing to say this a couple months ago. And I thought I remember saying that they were cutting off HDC production at like July 1st, basically. Oh, really? They were cutting that off. Now, that was also with the anticipation, I'm sure, that they were going to start producing the B. But, you know. I hope my goal is, my goal, my hope, my wish for them is to not rush it, to yeah. figure out manufacture you know what i mean to be ready yeah. when they say okay you don't want to say we're shipping the bees and then do 10 a week yeah for the next four years you know yeah. what i mean like i hope Agreed. they've got a, a a prototype and everything's looking well and they've got the uh the manufacturing set up and they're doing them and they're getting ready maybe you know like on august 1st or maybe at the end of q3 like around end of september they come out and they go check out this prototype it's freaking sweet. They show it and it's awesome. And everybody gets hyped and they go and shipping starts tomorrow and we're shipping out a thousand units a day, you know, or something yeah. crazy like that, where it's, it's like they pretty much got it ready right now, but they're holding back the information that they can because they want to come out guns fire. That's what I hope that's awfully ambitious. But if they did something like that, the coin would go up. People would be jacked. People would be so excited. Things would be good. That's the responsible thing to do too, though, right? Like, you know, it is. hold, hold it close to your chest. It makes, it's hard for people, right? But it's, we, it's we the talk about it all thing. the time in crypto and web three. It's hard to keep stuff like that secret because everything's so open source. Everything's yeah. so, you know, available to the public. That's why people are like, oh, hurry up and ship it, you know? because they've been talking about it since they started talking about it in the company. So yeah. it would be cool if this one thing they kind of held back and they were actually going to hit, hit their target on time. Even if it was the, they said quarter three, they didn't say the first of quarter three, they right. said quarter right. three, which means they have till September 30th to start shipping. And if they came out September 29th on my birthday and said, here's the prototype. <laughs> thank you mighty honey truck here is your camera we're shipping them all tomorrow and uh you know got all that stuff started shipping at, at the end of quarter three yeah, yeah, I in time for christmas now we're getting to the bottom of it it's selfish self notions that it's a hundred i'm running yeah, on your birthday well that would be that would just be the cherry on top you know i mean i'd love to have it before my birthday but Technically, yeah. my birthday is one day before the end of quarter three. So if they announce on September 29th and start shipping on September 30th, then they've officially hit their deadline for, I think, their first time in company history. Yeah. Well, it's yeah, it's we only feel this way because they're doing big things and we're making honey and it's uh, so yeah. you're excited. So obviously, you know, you can't wait for Christmas to get here. Absolutely. And like I said. I've got nothing negative to say. I can't even imagine what it's like do a company that's medium successful and they were so swamped with orders because everybody was making so much money that the first couple of months. I mean, it was just, it was a heck of a time to be alive. So I have nothing but love for the Hive Mapper project and I'm excited for the next step. Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Yeah, there's map coverage. That's you mapping. Buzz is obviously if you use the buzz button. Map mm -hmm. consumption is when somebody purchases map data that you've used that you have contributed to, and then founders reward is and that you're looking and you're looking at that under like the pay part of it because I guess I've never paid attention. So it's you can yeah. Just so see it. in the Hive Mapper app, you know where it shows yeah. you the tokens. It it yeah. tells you what the uh, what it's for. Yeah, map coverage, buzz, map consumption, whatever. But map consumption comes in as soon as they do it. So that's why it came in today, 7, 10, I got 40 you. minutes ago. 3.2 honey, which is almost 20 cents. 